Good morning folks, Rodney here. Let me see if I can get my chats up. Oh, let's see here. What do I want to do? I want to do a search. Do a Rodney Bell. Oh, wait a minute, there it is. Found it. I am live, yes sir. I am live, and I am sitting here on my front porch. It is cold. Danny, the view chaser, good morning. You mentioned the other day that you were having an operation too, and I just want you to know I've been praying for you, and I hope it all went well for you, Danny. Dennis Lovelady, good morning or afternoon or evening, whatever it is your time. Be red, good morning, Peter Carroll. Good day to you, sir. Uh, so, I am without glasses, I'm reading the chats really well from probably about three feet, I can read them, and that's just the left eye, just think what's going to happen when the right eye gets done, yes sir, let's get this drone up in the air and do the sunrise, instead of listening to me brag about my eyes I can't Take help off. it man it's like I've entered a whole new world home point updated I'm telling you, it's a whole new world right now. Now, as you can see, the, the sun has moved a bit on the horizon. It's heading towards its summer position. So... We'll follow that. Uh, well, I'm still thinking about it. Uh, uh, Scott, Jackrabbit FPV, will not be going live today. At least I don't think he will. He uh, said he had a lot of things to do. So he, uh, he asked to bow out, and I told him it was okay. That, that happens to all of us every now and then. So uh, there won't be any Jackrabbit FPV. And as soon as my wife leaves for work, I will probably do uh, Saturday morning coffee with Rodney and friends. And she usually leaves here about 7, 7, 10. So it should die. I'm going to guess around 7.30 is when Saturday morning coffee with Rodney and friends will happen. So uh, be on the lookout for that. And uh, let's see. Man, this guys i cannot tell you if if you need to have cataract surgery get it done because it, it's a whole different experience i haven't worn my glasses for like two and a half days now and i can see clearly now the caveat to that is is when i'm holding stuff up front i still need to put my glasses on but that's the only time now Oh, no, 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 no. Scott loves us. He just doesn't want to play with us today, that's all. <laughs> oh, there he is. Hey, Scott. Good morning, brother. Oh, okay, okay. So the plans have changed. He has his drone, and he said he can go live, so there it is. Jack Rabbit will be going live. So I'll start uh, Saturday morning coffee with Rodney and friends in that case right after he's done. And Scott, whenever you get done, you get done, man. Don't, you know, you just go until you're, you're ready to quit and then I'll, I'll come in with Saturday morning coffee with Rodney and friends. There's no time limit on you, brother. I can see clearly now. <laughs> That that actually is a uh, I think that actually is a title of a song. 
I can see clearly now. In fact, I was going to use that song on my next FPV video, which I flew yesterday. I flew one pack yesterday around the neighborhood just to see how it looked in the goggles. And to be honest with you, in, in the goggles, it really didn't change much because I have always had clear vision when I was wearing my goggles because first off I don't didn't use my glasses when I was wearing the goggles I, so and it being at the right distance appeared to, it looked clear as a bell so there wasn't that much difference uh, I guess there was some it looked a little brighter I suppose and, and then I think that's one of the big things everything looks brighter if I close my left eye then everything kind of looks like I'm looking through a yellow haze, like a smoky haze. And uh, But then when I open my left eye, everything is just clear as a bell. So it, it's almost hard, it's hard to describe. I hope that, that gave you an idea of what it's like right now. But as soon as the right eye gets done, everything's going to be really bright. But right now is amazing too, so... Anyway, sunrise is at 6.56. That's in about three minutes. At least that is what the weather app says. I am up higher, so the horizon is to further. I'm up at 307 feet, and it looks like it's coming up right now. So it's coming up at 7.53 and 31 seconds. That's what I'm calling it. So you can see it's coming up on the horizon. You will love it, Rodney. Yeah, <laughs> brother, I am already loving it. And I imagine when the right one's done, I'm going to love it even more. I know my wife's getting tired of me here talking about it, but I can't help it, man. I mean, I look at the moon now, the moon is over here off my right shoulder, and I can look at it, and it's not even got a haze around it. It's just as clear as it can be. So, I looked at the stars this morning, too, man. Phew! Nice. Yep, here because, oh, man, I, for, I forgot to hit record. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. See, that's what excitement can do. Make you forget everything. Oh, well. I've snapped a couple of pictures, so. But, yeah, it's uh, it's an amazing journey so far. Man. <laughs> You know, I always thought my yard was beautiful when, when when I had to wear glasses. It's even more beautiful now because it's a heck of a lot clearer. All right, enough about me. Barry Markowitz, good morning. Kirsho, good morning, Warren. Let me go through here. Lance Cadena, good morning. Tej, good morning. Scott, good morning. So, uh, folks, Danny the View Chaser, say some prayers for him for uh, quick healing. He is, he had some kind of surgery done yesterday. Mela, good morning. John, Flying Flynn Media, good morning. Chuck, good morning. Covation. Covaction, I'm sorry. Warren, good morning. Whew. It's a little bit nippy out here still. Yeah, I got my hoodie on, my heavy coat on. I need to maybe invest in some gloves for the winter too. Some some of those really nice gloves where you can operate stuff. I had some, but I can't figure out where they went.
You know, it is just so awesome to be able to look at my iPad and actually read the chats without glasses. <laughs> Dennis, you crack me up sometimes, brother. <laughs> Okay, so so Chuck is un, uh, Chuck's undercover name is Kevin. <laughs> That's hilarious, guys. That's just hilarious. <sighs> oh, I'm in camera mode. I can't zoom. That's the only downside to the Air Two, I guess. I don't know. Can you can you zoom with the other? The newer camera drones when you're in camera mode, not video mode. There you go, Mela. Just took a picture. I got a couple more on here too that I'll send you. Yes, sir, John. Another beautiful one. You know, I was looking at the the weather, one of the weather apps, and it says, "Oh, it's going to be raining," and, and, and it's going to, and they said it's going to be raining right in between these times of the sunrise. And I'm like, "Oh, come on!" And I looked out the window, and it was like clear as a bell, not a cloud in the sky that I can see. I mean, yeah, there are some clouds there. I know there's some contrails. Well, maybe they're not contrails. I don't know. Could be class. Anyway, regardless. So, I guess there are some clouds in the sky. Little puffy white ones. Oh, hey, we got reflection on the water, folks. We haven't had that in a while. Uh, okay, I, thanks, Brad. That answered my question. Uh, you can't do it in the Mavic 3, Dennis says, and he should know. He's, he's got one. <laughs> People call me Dennis White. <laughs> I've been called worse too in about 13 different languages. Man, this is a beautiful sunrise this morning. Let me uh, I'm gonna switch to video mode just so I can zoom. Mela, I am sorry I can't get a picture of that. That would be an awesome picture. Fortunately, when I go back to camera, that's what we get. But you know what? Let me... Uh, Oh, that's good right there. I just wanted to get up there and so we could see the reflection on the water. That that always tickles me. I mean, it's such a sweet, nice thing to, to see sometimes. I thought stupid lived in... <laughs> yeah, I probably could at that, yeah. In fact, I can just take a, sn a short snippet. 
and possibly get one right here at my desk okay so I took a short video so hopefully that will allow me to get a, a picture of that so but anyway Man, that the birds are just singing this morning. You know, the birds are all happy. The roosters, you know, I guess he's happy. He's crowing, so. Now, let's see. Don't look like anybody new has come into the chat recently. Thanks, Chuck. Big fish, good morning. Very nice, nice. Do you hear rooster? <laughs> yeah, I can understand that. Uh oh. All right. Duh. Saturday next weekend, I will probably be doing a sunrise from the South Florida drone meetup. Uh, probably won't do an, an official Saturday morning coffee with Rodney and friends, but I, I probably will go live at some point. Bum, good morning. So I'll be leaving here uh, Friday morning at 5.30 in the morning is what time my flight departs. I'll get into Orlando around 11 o'clock in the morning on Friday. I'll catch a rental car and then head to Stewart and meet up with everybody there at the hotel. And uh, then the festivities will begin. Oh, wow, Jim Bochart and Jordy, Jordy is uh, going through Richmond, and he's going to team up with uh, uh, Brad Austin. Jeez. And uh, they're going to convoy down. That's cool. Now I really wish I could go with Brad. That, that, that's just crazy. All right, well, it is what it is, so... At least I'll get to meet Jim at uh, the drone meetup. Oh, okay, Dennis. Good deal. Thank you. All right, boys, girls, I am going to bring this drone down. Scott, you should probably start getting ready, brother. Oh wow, there's a airliner flying right over me as I was looking up bringing the drone down. It looks pretty cool, man. Clear as a bell, too. Huh. Imagine that. Landing. Folks, 
Ah, uh, hang on a minute. I had to turn that strobe off. Anyway, folks, uh, that'll be it for me this morning. Don't forget, tomorrow morning is the Sunday Sunrise Cruise, starting with Charlie in New York, coming to me here in Virginia. Then to just Scott, uh, Jack Rabbit FPV, on over to Chris Hope in Texas, and then following Chris. I don't know that there's going to be a drones and coffee with Johnny, Johnny Drone Flyer on Sunday. I think I heard him say something that he wasn't going to have one on Sunday. So that's iffy. I don't know for sure. But if, if he does decide to have one, then he'll be after Chris Hope. Anyway, folks, uh, thanks for watching. You take care. Have a great weekend. Say a prayer for our country. Pray, say a prayer for our servicemen and women. Also say a prayer for our first responders. They, they need them too. Anyway, folks, uh, y'all have a great weekend. Love y'all. Bye now.